For example, mothers, what we are dealing with are Majibi six and Dalit six mothers. Now, do you know what the origin of this is? The origin of this, what is the origin of Majbi six? Guru Tekh Bahadur mothers, his body was mutilated. And he brought that body to Guru Gobind Singh. And he was a Chaman. The person who brought that body was a Chaman. So Guru Gobind Singh took him in his fold. And therefore the Chamars became part of the Sikh community. Now what has that got to do with this list? That's the historical context. Yes, because Mazibi means faithful. So there is also an entry with regard to Chamars. Yes. In Punjab. That's right. And that's why, Malas, your lordships find that the 32% of the population of Punjab. It's very brutal. Completely. 32% of the population is Dalits. More than any other state in this country. In the 21st century, Malas, we are looking at issues of equality, inequality, issues relating to how we ameliorate the conditions of those who have been sidelined for centuries, who have been humiliated for centuries, who have been ostracized for centuries. I don't think we can ever imagine how they were dealt with in the context of the caste structure that prevailed. So, Mulads, I think that we, the constitution makers in 1950, realized this. That is why the notification was issued in 1950. And they also realized that this is not going to stop. Because they gave the power to parliament, but this is an evolving situation. They gave power to parliament to deal with the matter. And, and it's unlikely that this is going to end very soon. It is in that context, Malat, that we must look at this matter. And what we can do, quite apart from reservation. For Malas, the two basic assumptions that Chanaya made, which were wrong, is number one, they considered the scheduled castes in the order as a homogeneous group. They assumed that this represents a homogeneous group. And I will demonstrate to your lordships that that assumption is based on no factual data. That assumption is based on no analysis of that data. What they hold is that once they find the place in that particular group, then they are all part. Homo homogeneous. What's the basis of that? In fact, heterogeneity is inherent in that. Actually, the homogeneous nature of all the entries is for the purpose of designation. Yes, That's absolutely. Right. They are homogeneous in the sense that each one of them is a scheduled caste. But they, your, your argument is that there is no homogeneity either in terms of the sociological profile, economic development, right. social advancement, absolutely. educational advancement. Absolutely. So that assumption in Chandiyah well, was wrong. common factor is social and uh, so social backwardness, social and economic backwardness. But the degree may the vary from one point absolutely, absolutely. to another end. Absolutely. So the assumption of homogeneity in Chennai itself is constitutionally flawed. That's the first mistake Chennai made. The second mistake Chennai made was that it correlated the presidential order with reservation. These are the two assumptions on the basis of which Chennaiya was rendered. Neither of these assumptions is valid. Because the designation is for the purposes of the constitution. That's correct. It's not only for reservation, for reservation nor is it coterminous with reservation. I'll go a step further. It has nothing to do with reservation. But as the designation of this class has nothing to do with reservation. Reservation emanates from the power of plenary power of parliament, which is in 16.4 for the purposes of no, no, employment. Not, not, because Indra Swani says that it can be done even by executive instructions. 
But now not anymore, Malaj. Because now it's parliament has to make a law, Malaj. What? Now parliament has to no, make what, a law to change the schedule, to change the schedule. Reservation in the Swanis goes on to say that it is not necessary that there has to be legislation. It can be done even by executive. State. Maybe, maybe, maybe so, Malaj. But that is not part of the, 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 uh, the, the notification. But that's nothing to do with reservation. My point is, Malaj, you are assuming... That, that may not be correct. Because if there is a reservation for scheduled cards, so unless that particular entry finds in the uh, 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 place in the presidential order, that uh, person no, that I, is I, not entitled. I, I, I just demonstrate that your lodges, wherever they wanted to give reservation, they have given it. Well, then reservation is part of 16.4 itself as no, far it's, as employment it's, is concerned. It's, an, it's a necessary but not a sufficient condition. Correct. Designation under Article 341 yes. is a necessary condition for reservation. But it is not sufficient in itself Correct. because having been designated, there is still an enabling power which is conferred upon the parliament or for that matter, brother says, uh, on the executive. Yes, but, but it's the union or the parliament, Malaz, but the, the, the order itself does, has no reference to resignation, uh, reservation and I'll show that from the chapter itself. Malaz, first of all, let me go to the first point yes. and then I'll come to the second point. And these are two assumptions I want to deal with immediately. Now, kindly I look at item 38 on the right hand side. Mochi. We all know, Malaj. Yes. yes. Now look at 34. Sapera. Sapera. Yeah, means snake, snake snakes. Jamas. Snakes. Snake jamas. One has nothing to do with the other. Look at Malaj's uh, Bazigar. He indulges in agropatic feats. Then Batwal Malaj. Actually belongs to the Rajput caste. Malaj is normally a watchman. So what you have an agglomeration of various castes which are put together who have been humiliated for centuries. The heterogeneity is clear from the table itself. I can go on, Malaj. There is one Gagara which has only 268 families in Jagraon in Ludhiana. There is a nut which is an unskilled labor. The Koli is the hunter and a butcher. The Sasi Malaj is a criminal, comes from that class. Koli would be fishermen. No, but originally came as hunters and butchers. Malaj. That is item Malaj. Uh, so there is heterogeneity 21. in terms of the pre existing occupation. That's right in terms of the resources or lack of resources exactly in terms therefore of all the indicators of backwardness or development exactly so therefore they are put in, in term, one class in term social uh, social status yes. this the status of every caste may not be the same in the social hierarchy as well exactly exactly, exactly. so that between them some may be a little more advanced some may be a little Correct. less advanced some way people may be particularly uh, underprivileged Correct. Absolutely. In terms of other indicators like infant mortality, maternal mortality, uh, fertility rates, which sort of define broadly speaking, you know, whether there has been progress in the uh, social indicators. Absolutely. Now that assumption was made by a observation of Justice Krishnayar in Thomas. Yes. Did he? Did Justice Krishna use the word homogeneity or? No, no. He said um, he doesn't use the word homogeneity at all, Malaj. I tell you, Lord, what he said. Just have a look at page, at um, uh, volume five, PDF eighty four, and this is Malad's, in fact, uh, um, uh, quoted by Justice Hegde, and then he comes to the conclusion that they are one class. Now, just see Malad's that we may clear the clog of Article sixteen two as it stems from a confusion about caste in the terminology of scheduled castes and scheduled tribes. This latter expression has been defined in 341 and 342. A bare reading brings out the quintessential concept that they, brackets there, are no castes in the Hindu fold, but an amalgamation of castes, races, groups, tribes, communities, or parts thereof found on investigation to be the lowliest and in the need of massive state aid and notified as such by the president to confuse this backwardness, backwardmost social Composition with caste is to commit a constitutional error misled by a compendious appellation so that to protect Harijans is not to produce prejudice any caste but to promote citizen solidarity. In fact, by using the expression this mixed bag, yes. 
the learned judge is really underscoring the homo the heterogeneity of the exactly group. exactly then in the latter part he says but as a large backward group that's correct. deserving of societal compassion correct. now this is quoted by justice hegde and can comes to the conclusion that it forms a class now kindly have a look at that the way of doing it is that not to deny that they form a class, but they form a class for the purpose of Article 341. That's right. That's right. Absolutely. So, they may be a class for certain purposes. They may not be a class for all purposes. That's correct. Right. Basically, what you said in our submission. There is a, a, a level of, what should I say, mother, discrimination, which runs through this entire list. But their vocations may be different. Their historical... Uh, 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 the way they were treated may be different. There, there may be so many differences. The numbers may be different. The extent of discrimination also may be different. Level of discrimination may be different. Chuda, he was a sweeper. A twisty, twisty. Ah, whatever. He was a twisty. One who, yes, whatever. He was water. A ah, there are others also. With the list also, there are lots of... Anyway. That happened, Milord, near Chandni Chocolate. The incident. Yes, of course. Uh, I, I'm, I'm quite familiar with it. We just said... Gurdwara uh, is there. Now, Milord, just come to... Yeah, just come to uh, this volume. Uh, PDF 796 of the same volume. Paragraph 23, where he quotes, Milord, the learned judge quotes Justice Krishna here. That's the 135 that I read to your Lordship. Para? 135. No, no, no. Para 23, where he quotes 135, which I've read to your Lordships. And then he says in Para 24, the learned judge, according to Justice Krishna here, though there are no castes, races, groups, tribes, communities, or parts thereof in Hinduism, the president on investigation, having found some of the communities within the amalgam as being lowliest and in need of massive state and aided, and state aided in aid including them in one class called the scheduled caste. The secretary thereof is that the scheduled castes are one class for the purpose of the constitution. One is not that conclusion is ex facie wrong. So I've demonstrated heterogeneity. I've demonstrated Mullahs that the basis of the judgment is that there is homogeneity. That assumption is wrong. 